welcome. I'm Michelle Kreitz, professor in the biology department. Welcome to our new lab space. This is our lab space that we teach human anatomy and physiology in. We also teach comparative anatomy in this space, and we teach an independent cadaver prosection course. So this lab space gets used by a lot of students on campus. Um, we do have some biology majors that use this space, for instance, for the cadaver prosection course and for comparative anatomy. But we also serve a large number of non-biology majors in this lab. So one of the things that we um, have really enjoyed about this space is all the new shelving that we have in the lab. Um, this includes spaces for all of our microscopes. These models used to be stored in the back room and um, having them all out here in the lab allows students to go and get the models that they need when they need them. Part of the remodel was purchasing sufficient models so that we can have uh, enough models to go around to the students. Prior to the remodel, we had three torso models that were in good working shape. And so the fact now that we have all of these torsos to go around to all the students um, has really made a big difference in their learning. We have two large TV screens here in the back of the lab and we have two screens in the front, the smaller one in the corner, and then the projector screen in the front. And we can project uh, various things up onto the screens. Sometimes I project uh, our lab that we're doing that day so that the students can be seeing um, in print what they're doing uh, in front of them as well as whatever they've got in front of them on the table. And then one of the things that we uh, we're so excited to receive in this lab is this virtual dissection table and this uh, table was made taking actual images from real cadavers so there are four digital cadavers on this table and um, essentially the students can do dissections of this cadaver virtually and that can help them to make sense of what they're seeing you know, on the models and then also make sense of what they're seeing on our actual cadavers. They can kind of go back and forth between the two and be able to experience it in a different way. So it really has a lot of features um, that help the students learn. And then in addition to that, if there's something on this that I really want to show the students that I think is particularly useful, I can actually project this up onto the various screens in the lab and so that I know that everybody is seeing what I want them to see. You know, we have 24 students per class in this lab, and so getting 24 people around a particular specimen, whether that's, you know, a dissected specimen or this table would be very challenging. And even getting them around, you know, a cadaver gurney is challenging, and so having the ability to project this um, from the table up to the screens has been really invaluable.